Hey friends, Jason here from Kern Initiatives. Um, as you know, for the past 10 years, uh, our major initiative, uh, one of three that we do, has been the Laundry Project. Uh, obviously, laundry is very, very close to us, very close to our hearts, something we do to help families in need uh, in about seven states all over the country. But our home base is right here in Florida. Uh, our home is Tampa, Florida. My personally, my hometown is Panama City, Florida. It's where I grew up, it's where my family lives, where a lot of my family still lives. and. Um, We've all seen the devastation that's happened there from Hurricane Michael in the past week. And um, one of the things that we have been developing over the past couple years that uh, right now, if we had it on the road, would be a great way and a perfect way to help those families in need. One of the biggest struggles that they're going to have and that they, uh, uh, there's always in a disaster area is clean laundry and it fits naturally with the laundry project. We work with laundromats and we will be working with laundromats in those areas to provide free laundry services for families in need. Um, but one of the ways that we want to develop a step further than that to help with natural disasters it, when another Hurricane Michael uh, comes through Florida at some point that we can be on the ground quicker and, and uh, more efficiently is through the development of what we're calling the Garrett Gilkey Mo Mobile Laundry Unit. This is a brochure for it right here. Hopefully you'll be seeing these around, getting them in, in the mail possibly. Garrett Gilkey is one of our great friends. He's a former uh, offensive lineman with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Uh, it was kind of his brainchild a couple years ago. And we want to use it in a couple ways. One is to uh, help homeless communities, that uh, people that can't even get to a laundromat, we're going we're gonna to bring a laundromat to them in a food truck style mobile laundromat. But the bigger way, or another way, and a larger way that we can help uh, use that truck is right now with a situation like Hurricane Michael. If we had this on the road right now and it was already, it was already built, we'd be in Panama City, we'd be in Mexico Beach, we'd be in those cities right now helping families uh, independently of laundromats because we can self-contain the water Everything is run on natural gas uh, and self-contained water. And then we can also plug into a water source and just run indefinitely. That's one of the things that we wanna do, but we need your help to get there. We've been working on it. We're about halfway to our goal of $300,000 uh, to raise all the money to build this thing custom. We've got about $150,000 in the bank or committed to it. And we need your help to get the rest of the way there so that we can, for the next natural disaster, we can be there quicker and more efficiently to help families in a faster way. And as you know, and I know, putting on clean clothes uh, just in everyday life is very dignifying. Uh, it's hope-filled for people that um, don't get to do it on a regular basis, but especially during a natural disaster. Uh, when, when all is lost, homes are lost, a lot of things are gone, being able to wash the clothes that you have put those back on and just feel good about yourself to help you get in a mental space of being able to clean up and take the next step to get back on your feet. And we want to help in that way. Uh, I really want to help in a big way right now because it's my hometown of Panama City. But looking to the future for cities that may uh, face this kind of disaster, we want to be there. So help us do that. If you go to laundrytruck.org, what I'm asking you to do is to go to that website click the donate link and give any dollar amount that you can afford. Every dollar counts towards this goal. And also, if you'll share that link to your friends, do it through social media. Um, let's try to help it go viral with your friends, with people to help make this thing a reality. Send it to your business contacts. Anyone that you know that might wanna sponsor this, to be a business sponsor. We've got some great sponsors right now, but we need more. So please help us do that. Go to laundrytruck.org, help us make this a reality so the next time a disaster like this comes through, we can be there quicker, we can help those families. And then also right here in our town of, Pan of Tampa, Florida and surrounding areas that we can help homeless families that are, uh, don't even have the ability to get to a laundromat, that we can take it to them, we can bring that hope and service of clean laundry to them uh, in a very quick, easy way. Go check it out. You'll see a video there about the, the truck and what it's going to look like and what it's going to do. And then you can also donate and be a part of this. So thanks for, uh, thanks for jumping in with us to help families in need. And uh, look forward to uh, reporting back to you that we have met our goal and that we have full development going on with this truck. Thanks. Talk to you soon.